Right, right. Nice. Oh yeah. Getting this party started right. Hell yeah. Do some work. Alrighty. Here's my coffee. She's a bowling. Hey guys, been at it for a while. So, um, so as you may have seen, I keep um, this pile right here. I keep messing with it, as you see off and on, and that's that's mainly because it's still pretty. Um, well, a few reasons because it's still not so hot out, so there's not as many critters. I need to get that cleared before it gets summertime or as cleared as possible. And the other reason is there's several logs in here, here and there, and a few over there that I need to get out of there to use for my wall and other things. But I gotta get as much of this brush cleared out of the way and it's just, it is so slow going. But just chopping away and making dents, small dents at a time. I mean, it used to come out to like, let's see, it used to come out to like right here. So I'm gonna back up a little bit, there we go. So it used to come all, this whole area used to be this high with just, all of this shit and this shit so we're making a dent by dent and we're getting the wall 
she's coming along pretty nicely uh, haven't gotten too far because I set up camp about an hour and a half ago or something like that and just been getting going sweet fires going got some sweet coffee made I'm about to take a break and uh, yeah we're gonna try and get her up to about this area um, but we will see I may have made a few <laughs> few errors so these really long ones at the bottom I'm cool with that like that worked for me but then I kind of just got in work mode and wasn't really thinking um, and at the top it started to taper like this which isn't too bad um, but you know I'm gonna have to figure out how to fill this gap or keep extending it out which is not that was not in the cards but I don't know we'll see so I just have to jigsaw the the logs to fill in this area as it goes up and then somehow fill in that area but I'm learning as I'm going so I don't know I'm having a good time so another glorious day with my ancestors and bushcraft I'm gonna take a break and get back to it So, for a while there I was limbing up all the logs with the chainsaw, which did make pretty quick use of it, but it also used up a lot of gasoline and stuff, so I started using these, you know, larger size pruning, man, it goes faster with this, you waste a lot less uh, uh, gas, and for the bigger ones you can't use with, uh, with these, I just use my, my axe, comes right off, it's same speed. If not, maybe sometimes a little bit quicker because chainsaw can jam up. It uh, needs to be tightened sometimes, run out of gas and everything like that. So these, and obviously always this and my hatchet have been my biggest tools I've been using throughout the whole time. And like I said, I busted out the chainsaw to get like the bigger logs just to cut them. Uh, not so much to limit anymore, but to cut them to length and everything because I was sawing it by hand. But fuck me, dude. When you got a, a log that's this big around, the size of your fucking head, it took me like 20 minutes to saw through it. And then you're just depleted, so, you know, take some shortcuts here and there. Whatever, you know, having a good time doing it. Um, I'm, I'm not a purist to bushcraft, but I enjoy it, so cool. Let's keep working, have a good time. Okay, that's all I could do today. Starting to get rained on. I got some more logs, but we're we're going. I had to redo it as I talked about it. Take them all out and restack it again because it was uneven. And so my battery's about to die. It's starting to fucking rain, and uh, I don't want my shit get all rained on. So I'll be back out here next week, and uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Click like and subscribe if you liked. Peace.